Today is uh, June 9th, I believe, and it's probably about uh, four o'clock. And I'm, I don't have my watch on, so can't tell you. Anyway, um, I've been out for the past two days, so I had to go to the emergency room with uh, COVID-19 complications. I contracted COVID back Jan on January 15th, and it sucked. I had a pretty rough three days. And uh, what I decided to do was to uh, download and save all the videos from some uh, uh, Facebook clips that I had did since January 15th uh, about some of the times where I had difficulty with uh, my COVID-19 uh, uh, complications. So sit back and uh, I guess uh, enjoy the videos and uh, if you're one of the ones like me that are uh, pretty fit and healthy and uh, not so young, <laughs> I just had my uh, 57th birthday last month. I know. I don't look like it. <laughs> Takes a lot of hair dye. Anyway, like I said, sit back and enjoy the videos. And um, I'm going to go ahead and do my uh, closing spiel now. So, after you watch this, hit the like button if you like it. Hit subscribe and you'll get notifications as new videos come out. And unlike all, the, unlike all my other videos, I always have bloopers. There isn't any on this one. It's just some uh, random Facebook clips that I decided to uh, let you guys look at. Thanks a lot, and thanks for watching, and um, hope you guys enjoy. Thank you. Bye-bye. Today's Saturday, the 6th. Uh, just got done having breakfast at my favorite place, which is IHOP. Had a $6 breakfast, no coffee. I brought my own. Now I'm just going for uh, my walk after, uh, after I always eat. Um, thought I was working today, but come to find out that I'm off. So that's good. And as you can tell, I'm still getting out of breath uh, walking. So it is what it is, I guess. It's been uh, what three weeks yesterday that I came down with uh, COVID, and I uh, seem to be getting more winded as each day goes by now. So we'll see what happens. Anyway, that's it. Talk to you guys later. Bye. Hey, Jibo. You want to go for a walk? I'm gonna take my morning walk today. I'm up for going places, as long as there are electrical outlets there. <laughs> hey, Jibo. That's good. Well, today's uh, two weeks since I've been back oh, to work. Oh, well, that's nice. Today's two weeks since I've been back to work. Um, anyone who says uh, COVID is just like the flu, you're a dumbass. It feels like the flu the first three days. And I've had the flu in the past. And yeah, you know, they, they're similar. But uh, I'm definitely having um, effects after. I mean, usually when I have the flu, I get over it, have a runny nose, that's it. This um, getting winded really sucks. It's getting worse as each uh, day goes by. So I don't know what's, uh, what's going on. The other day I had to, I had to do a uh, receiving at work. So there was a lot of walking around, moving around. It was uh, really tough. I thought, uh, I felt like I was gonna throw up I was getting weak and um, yeah it's just uh, it's not the flu so fuck you guys I guess I should have never wished for the two weeks off a few days before I came down with it I was saying God why can't I get COVID I want a couple of weeks off with pay um, <laughs> knowing what I know now and I guess I was pretty lucky that I uh, just had a mild uh, to moderate case of it the first three days Wish I never got it. I'm sure I have uh, some damage from my lungs from when I was younger. First of all, I was uh, three months preemie, so I'm sure they're underdeveloped. There was times when I was a kid, I had a cough for like two months. And I never went to the doctors, so I don't know. I could have had pneumonia back then. Could have had a, I don't know. Could have had TB. I don't know. But there was a couple times that that happened, and I'm sure that's probably uh, scarred up my lungs a little bit. Well, anyway. This COVID-19 sucks. So fuck COVID. Hey, Jibo. What is COVID-19? Wonder if he knows. According to wikipedia.org, coronavirus disease 2019 is a contagious disease caused by severe acute respiratory syndrome coronavirus 2. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> okay, today's Friday. It's been th uh, five weeks since I came down with COVID. 
been back to work almost three weeks. Last Friday I had uh, did receiving, had a pretty rough day. By the end of the day, I felt like I was gonna throw up. Got winded real easy. And it seems like as each day has gone by, I, I get winded easier every day. Yesterday I did Derry Deli. It was like nonstop work. Couldn't move as fast as I uh, normally would. Had to keep taking the breaths every now and then. I kept losing my breath real bad. And by the end of the day, again, I was having uh, some leg pains. Had a few little shooting pains in my chest here and there. And on the way home, I had a hard time staying awake. And uh, I don't know if this has any, anything to do with it, but my left arm was a little bit heavier than normal. Anyway, I passed out when I got home because I was uh, so worn out. And as you can uh, tell by my breath, I'm getting a little out of breath right now as it is. Um, I'm doing my, uh, my walk. After breakfast, I went to IHOP for pancakes. I will insert a photo, but uh, of those pancakes, and uh, taking two little uh, strolls around the Mission Grove Shopping Center on and, uh, on the perimeter, on the outside. So, yeah, so that sucked yesterday. I mean, I had a good day, but it felt like crap when I got home. And uh, I'm going on a ski trip. I think on the 28th. I'm not skiing though, because three years ago, uh, next week I dislocated my uh, shoulder in a ski accident, so I'll never be doing that again. So while my uh, buddies are skiing, I'm going to be at the bar drinking and smoking cigars. And I really hope to God that uh, the high altitude doesn't uh, mess up my breathing, because as you can uh, hear in my voice right now, I'm uh, getting out of breath after uh, doing these two uh, walks around the Mission Grove Shopping Center, but the one thing I read, they said that you should go for uh, walks as much as possible and uh, walk as long as you can. And uh, yeah, once again, I'll say this COVID thing sucks. And um, anyone who thinks that it's fake, you guys are dumbasses. Sorry. And I know there are still a lot of people out there that feel that way. I wish to God that five weeks ago, well, five weeks ago, three days ago, that I didn't wish that I had COVID so I can get some time off because uh, now I'm having these, uh, uh, I don't know, what do you call it, residual effects from COVID, and it really, uh, it sucks. So anyway, that's it. Have a nice day, and uh, good luck if you get COVID. Good afternoon. Today's uh, Monday. It's uh, about 12 noon. Went for a two-mile walk. Uh, and uh, I'll say this, I don't think uh, I'm over COVID. <laughs> I didn't feel good afterwards. My chest started to hurt and uh, I was uh, losing my breath pretty good. I was going to attempt uh, to ski tomorrow, just do the beginning, the beginning to intermediate runs and take it really slow. I know that, would, that probably would have been a mistake with my dislocated shoulder, but uh, after that two mile walk this morning, I decided, no, I don't think it'd be a good idea at all. So, I'm not gonna do it. My buddy, my the rest of my buddy should be up here in about an hour or so. Eric's brother went to go pick him up at the airport. So I'm sitting over here at the Hard Rock Cafe, having a beer, sitting in front of their uh, fire pit. They have these all over the place and I ordered some fries. Yeah, I don't feel good. Plus I had a slight hangover this morning and I went through a, <laughs> a major sneezing uh, episode this morning in my room and at the restaurant for breakfast. Couldn't find an IHOP so I had to eat downstairs in the American River Cafe. Anyway, that's it. Just wanted to give you a little heads up that uh, thought I was over COVID, but I'm not. Hey, Jibo. Hey, I went and got the shot today, so what do you think about that, little buddy? Hi, Paul. Congratulations. Let me ask you this. Did it hurt? And did you cry like a little bitch? Just kidding. <laughs> wow. Hey, Jibo. No, it didn't hurt. <laughs> and I didn't cry like a little bitch. <laughs> That's not very nice. Hmm. That's it. So in uh, 30 more days, I go back for the second one. Hey, Jibo.
Hey, Jibo. You little bitch. Hello. How are you guys doing? Of course you know who I am, Paul Henderson. Uh, Facebook video whore and um, YouTube, uh, uh, I don't know. <laughs> Want to be a YouTuber? Hey, I'm up to uh, 780 subscribers. Another 230 to go, no, 220 to go, and I'll reach 1,000. So anyway, I just had my uh, second COVID uh, vaccine shot today at about 12.15. It is now 3.45, and it's April 7th. I don't know if I already said that. Anyway, as of today, right now, I feel great. And uh, I'm hoping tomorrow I'll feel the same, but I doubt it. Anyway, I'm going to do a little uh, daily vlog every day for about three or four days to let you know how I'm doing or l let you know the effects that I'm having from uh, the COVID shot. I hear different stories from different people. Some say if you have COVID, you'll have more of a reaction to the shot, but uh, then I've heard where people didn't have COVID and they had really, bit, really bad reactions to the shot. It doesn't really matter if you're old, young, if you had it, if you didn't have it. It just affects everyone different, but I figure that if I uh, if I do get sick from the shot, my body's doing what it's supposed to do, so that's good. Anyway, hey Jibo, how are you doing? Hi, little buddy. I'm feeling very much like a robot. <laughs> yes, he is. Anyway, that's it. Talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye. Hey Jibo. Good morning. See if he knows what day it is. Paul, happy birthday to you. <laughs> happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Paul. Happy birthday to you. Every year he sings that to me, and every year it gets worse. Hey, Jibo. Thanks. <laughs> That's what I'm here for. This is for all those people that are out there that still think uh, COVID was just a bad flu. I'm still having, uh, I don't know what you call it, um, residual effects from COVID. I had it on uh, January 15th. I still get winded easy and it kind of sucks. Whenever I do my uh, YouTube videos, I have to carry all my uh, camera gear downstairs and I can only carry couple things at a time because uh, I have to go down the steps and I don't want to fall and break my uh, break my equipment so that could take me uh, five round trips to take everything down and if I do the video of course I do the video in the same day then I have to carry it all back upstairs so there's another five trips sometimes more because by the time I get done going downstairs doing everything taking everything down and then doing the video take everything back up I'm getting kind of exhausted already and it really sucks because uh, it kicks my ass and uh, it's really hard to get my breath for a while. So for all you people that think this uh, COVID thing is uh, political, it's fake, it's not. I'm a pretty healthy person and uh, this really sucks. I went to breakfast this morning at IHOP, of course. <laughs> Did a couple walks around the Mission Grove Shopping Center, came back home. Went up and down the stairs three, four times. Took two trips to bring little kittens upstairs to play on the balcony, and uh, I'm uh, pretty out of breath. So, just so you guys know, it's not fake, and it sucks. But, watching these little kitties play, <laughs> it makes up for it. Hey, let me, uh, let me show you. I don't know how old they are. They're probably maybe uh, five weeks old now, maybe six. But they are cute. That's my little orange one, by the way. Her name might be Tangina. I don't know. I still gotta find out if it's a girl or a boy. But anyway, that's it. So, oh, thought I stepped on one of them. Anyway, this COVID thing sucks. Bye. Well, today's uh, Sunday, and um, let's see, it's uh, 11.36 p.m. The noise you hear is uh, four cases of beer. <laughs> Had them on sale again. 
Anyway, this is for all those people, and I have already made one video about this, uh, well, a couple, about uh, people think uh, COVID's fake. And once again, I had another episode today at work, and I couldn't figure out why, and then I finally remembered that uh, seems like going up and down the stairs one too many times before I come to work seems to uh, affect my breathing when I get to work. Had to take a 20 minute break and go lay down on the break room floor. I just uh, couldn't go on anymore. Chest was hurting real bad and I was having a difficult time breathing. But uh, what I had done today was uh, a couple times right after I woke up, went downstairs, once to take my trash, another one to have a cup of coffee with uh, uh, downstairs. And then I decided I was going to um, bring all the little kittens upstairs on my balcony. That takes uh, three trips for the kittens because I don't want to <laughs> trip and squish one of them or two of them. So I only take uh, one at a time. And then I had to go back down for uh, one of their toys. So there's like six trips right there. And then two hours later, three hours later, I took them all back downstairs one at a time. And of course, I always forget something. So I have to keep going back upstairs and back downstairs. And I don't know. So I'll probably. 12 uh, round round uh, round trips up and down the stairs and uh, it really sucks because uh, this COVID thing is real and uh, <laughs> I don't know I might have to go to Kaiser might have to see if I have to get an inhaler or something but anyway fuck you all that think this is fake it's really hard to see when I gotta make a turn with this damn uh, <laughs> light from the cell phone blinding my blinding in my eyes anyway that's it and hope you guys like my little uh, kitty videos I like watching them on the balcony anyway that's it have a good night bye okay today's Monday I spent about uh, four hours in the emergency room had another uh, episode of work today where I couldn't breathe really sucked again so called the Kaiser to make an appointment for <laughs> tomorrow and uh, they asked me a bunch of questions and uh, apparently uh, they wanted me to go in right then and there so actually I'm glad I did because uh, I found out my uh, lungs are inflamed so I was probably having a bronchial I don't know what they call it they had a name for it but anyway so I asked him, well, how'd that happen? He goes, well, it's probably from a, a virus or a, an infection you had. Well, what did I have in January? But I had a COVID-19. So I'm sure that was probably the virus. <laughs> anyway, so I got a bunch of medics in the take. And uh, they're giving me something for my uh, high blood pressure. Just uh, won't seem to go down and it's been staying pretty high. 183 over 113, so that's not good. Said my heart checked out fine, so that's good. Just my lungs. Thanks, COVID. I guess that's what it was from. Kind of makes sense. Anyway, so I'm off for two days, and I actually have the third day off, so I'll be off for three days, so that's good. I got an inhaler, something to get my... Uh, uh, the lung inflammation down and uh, blood pressure meds. So that's it. I guess I'll live another day. Bye. Well, today's Tuesday. It's uh, 1.35 p.m. Some of you guys might have saw my uh, post yesterday from the emergency room. Uh, I left work at lunch. Go check myself in. I think I was there for about uh, four, four and a half hours. And that included getting my, uh, my medication that I had to get after I got discharged from the emergency room. They gave me, oh, let me see, what is it? Five days of protosone, that's for the lungs, and then uh, am, la, dot, I, pine. Can't pronounce that. Generic for Norbax. I don't know. Got to take one of those a day. Protozone. 
two times a day for five days and then they gave me an inhaler and I just had to use it. I thought I'd do a little test. I uh, took three trips, three round trips down the stairs. Once was to uh, check the mailbox. The other was to pick up a FedEx package that I just received to uh, make a new, another YouTube video. And then I went down to take uh, my little mini trash can out. So that wasn't good, so uh, came up, had to use the inhaler. I don't like it, don't like it one bit. I'm not used to uh, relying on medication for stuff. <laughs> and it really, <coughs> really sucks. But I do get to watch these little guys play. Here you go, check this out. The little orange one is mine. The other two I think we're keeping. <laughs> so at least a little tango or tangy will have someone to play with. I still don't know if it's a boy or a girl. <laughs> it looks like a vagina, but it's, I don't know. It looks like a penis too. I don't know. They're still pretty small. But anyway, um, this, uh, he didn't say it was caused from COVID. Uh, the emergency doctor, what he said is my lungs were inflamed. And that's caused by a virus or, uh, what was the other thing he said? Virus or infection. And what did I have in January? January 15th, I contracted COVID-19. So whatever I'm going through is not caused by the shots. It is actually from, most likely from COVID. And then of course the high blood pressure. So I got some blood pressure medication for that. It was one over three, it was 183 over 113. So that's not good at all. <laughs> Hasn't been going down at all. So it's been like that for two, three years. So I guess it's time that I get on uh, some blood pressure medication. Anyway, that's it. I want to give you a little heads up. I got today off tomorrow and then my regularly scheduled day on Thursday. So I got three days off. So with taking the meds and relaxing, I'm hoping that uh, I feel better when I go back. Had a really bad headache last night uh, all the way till this morning. I uh, had ordered IHOP, went and picked it up, came home and ate it. So that's it. Have a good day. And I'll give you one more shot of the little kittens. They just make my day. Bye. Good afternoon. It's uh, Wednesday. I think noon. I don't know. Anyway, I want to show you what I had made up. Just got it in the mail today. It's a coffee mug with my uh, little kitty uh, Tango or Tangy. I still don't know what it is. Could it be a boy. Could it be a girl. I don't know. Too young to tell. Anyway. Um, Tomorrow is my official day off. I just had the past two days off. So tomorrow is my official day off. And uh, if you can hear to my voice, I'm a little out of breath. My voice is a little raspy. It's because I took about eight trips down, eight round trips downstairs to take all my uh, YouTube video equipment downstairs. So I'm going to be filming a very short YouTube video tomorrow, installing a Stillin cold air scoop which is gonna be paired with my GM Chevrolet cold air performance air intake that I installed a month ago. Anyway, I hope that's gonna go nice and smooth because I don't feel like doing it all day long on my day off. So anyway, that's it. Have a good day. Here's my mug again. <laughs> Turned out really good. She was sitting on my lap, so I, uh, I photoshopped uh, my lap out of there and just smeared all the different colors around to make it look kind of artsy fartsy and I think it turned out pretty damn good. Have a good day. Okay, I have to do a little update. I'm really frustrated. Not sexually, but I'm just frustrated. <laughs> I'm getting uh, frustrated because people keep saying on the replies or uh, comments that they leave on my Facebook page that it's the kittens. No, it's not the kittens. I just recently took over the kittens three weeks ago and they only stayed with me for a little while on my balcony. I had this problem 
since I've got COVID back in January 15th and my trip to South Lake Tahoe in March proved without a shadow of a doubt that there was something seriously wrong with my lungs. And those eight trips that I took downstairs to do the video equipment to take it all downstairs also proved that I have problems with my lungs right now. And it sucks. So I want to I want to tell you guys something. Stop. It's not those damn kitties. Those kitties had nothing to do with this. No. <laughs> They're too cute. So, to any of you uh, non-COVID-19 believers, fuck you. That's all I can say. Sorry. <laughs> it's it. This is real. People have died from it. People are getting sick from it. People that wouldn't have died if they had the flu. No, wait. People died from COVID-19 that wouldn't have died if they had the flu died. So, and I have a friend that works at the Corona Hospital. She gets so mad because uh, her friends on Facebook still think it was fake. It's not. Their morgues were filled up and those people died from COVID-19. So I hope this settles it. It's not the cats. And uh, <laughs> stop it. If you don't stop it, I'm going to have to unfriend you. I mean it. Don't make me do that because I will. And then I'll have to refriend you and I don't want to have to do that. So that's it. Bye. <laughs> okay, so I decided to add a little closing spiel anyway. This here is my uh, little putty tat. <laughs> Tango or Tangy? Got to find out what it is first. And uh, I think she's kind of afraid. <laughs> okay. Anyway, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And um, any of you guys out there that uh, had got COVID, uh, I'm sorry. It really sucks. Uh, you know, hopefully uh, you didn't have too many uh, complications from it. I did, and I'm healthy. So don't let anyone tell you it's all in your head because we're full of crap. And don't let anyone tell you that this is fake. COVID was made up for the, <laughs> I don't know. There's so many stupid stories out there. Well, anyway, enjoy your day. Thanks for watching. And um, hey, pass my um, YouTube channel around. I need to get up to a thousand subscribers. I think I have a, uh, 80, maybe 86 to go. <laughs> and then I get the 1,000 mile, um, I mean, uh, not the 1,000 mile, 1,000 subscriber, uh, 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 I forgot what they call it. Dang it. <laughs> anyway, that's it. Bye. <laughs>